older. Sometimes I want to come on here and be like, aye, aye, Captain. You know, but copyrights and stuff here. SpongeBob. Sponge, I don't like SpongeBob. It's my shite. Okay, guys. Uh, to the point here, because I'm rambling. We're going to rank my ABH palettes, which I actually should probably put these in order real quick, you know? Okay, those are in order. We get the bigger ones all sorted out. Oh, sweet Jesus, I just lost them all to the floor. Okay, here we go. So I have two, four, six, seven ABH palettes that we are ranking today, starting from our first most used to the last most used. So first on our list is a very, a very controversial we liked it or we absolutely hated it palette and that's some culture this is my all-time fave palette from them i love this it's a favorite i got another powder and another one as you can tell i'll be using this sucker oh oh no look at this guys i've had this thing for so long it's popping out that's sad i'm gonna have to fix that anyway but this is my favorite palette here I've got currently got a big dip in Edge. New Wave has a big dip. Destiny has a dip. We got one in All Star. Electric has one. Colors, it gets used. She's in a makeup way. I'm over here freaking swatching things. Alright, here we go. Mustard colored all over my finger. I said that on my iPad. Oops. Okay. Our next one is the Prism palette. Ooh, yeah, ignore the cat here. Use velvet. Velvet packaging is a demise. It's like, why do you hate me? I have two cats and one sheds, waffle sheds so bad. And I can't do nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Can't keep the hair off of it save my life. Anyway, but in our number two spot is the Good Prism palette. Oh, I love this color story too. It's why she's in number two. Like we have dips, dips in Eden, Spear, Saturn. Starting to go on a parallel. Dimension has it. Lucid, Throne, Osiris. We're getting dips in all of them. You can pretty much see some of the visible ones. That's our number two spot. Number three would be the Riviera. We love her. I got pink in my seaside here. Sad. But like, you know, we got dips in the state. Bahamas, Canes, Mediterranean, Inheritance. Palomero starting to get one. She, she gets used. That was our number three spot. Number four would have to be the Jackie Ina palette. Oh man, this is nice too. This is this one only has like maybe dips in like two shades, two or three. But she gets used. I like it. Although I think the last look I did with it, I wasn't too happy, but I think I just didn't color com combo good and it just ruined it for me. Oh. Earthquake, guys. Just kidding. I'm, I bumped the thing. And uh, the first, the first three I showed you that had the bigger dips was when I had like a smaller like ten palette collection, you know. And then I got the work in, got our shit together, and I was like cruising, you know. What number was I on? Five. Number five is the ABH Norvina Volume Three. I love this. My husband bought this for me. Mirror coming out. Okay. Anyway, my husband bought this one for me. Oh, yes. This is my my favorite color scheme with him. 
And actually, if you go through my videos, I have a get ready with me with a 19's love child using this. I love this. I just love this palette. Now this palette has like even more meaning to it. So this is never going anywhere. Besides the fact that my husband bought it and I was using my first get ready with me collect. Oh God. Too, I'm a little too excited here. I'm about to get my entire top shelf lipsticks. Whoops. Anyway, it's like my first collab get ready with me video palette I use in my video that's never going anywhere husband got it for me definitely it's on lock number six is the volume two from Norvina collection from ABH look at these deep blue tones with the greens and yellows oh, look there's a teal I've got pink you know orange I love it it's black here it's just it's such a good color scheme you know and I really like that these palettes are like B1, B2. I kind of feel like I'm playing Battleship. Battleships, but only with Battle Shades. Battle Pigments, away! That's what it reminds me of. And coming in good old number 7 is the Volume 4 from Nervina. Mainly because, I don't know why. Why well, I think I got this because of the hype, yo. It was so hyped up. Like, this is, I, maybe it's the lack of, to me, variety in here, maybe. I don't know. Maybe I just haven't used it. It's often like there's like one purple here. To me, it's this, meh. She's all right. She ain't bad enough to where we gonna get rid of it. But she's good enough to where I was still using keep it, you know what I mean? That's why she's in number seven, or number seven spot. And that is my ranking from most used to least used ABH eyeshadow palettes. Thanks for watching, and hope to see you in the next one. Bye.